I've just experienced the car with you guys. So, so um, um, starting from the grill, the grill is uh, is nice. The front view is really nice. Yeah, you can see camera center, parking center, and it's also the same on this side of the car. Ah, this is nice. LEDs and uh, okay. cars that have this uh, orange thing here, rather right, uh, American spec cars, and it is their uh, it's what's their safety regulation. Here has to be orange, and uh, if you come over to the back, here it has to be red. <coughs> the back seat. Ooh. Oh, it's really hot in here. Um, yes. This is really nice. This is really nice, and there's a lot of space here. I don't know why. I don't really know why uh, Land Rover doesn't put a, a third row seat. Okay, this option. I know that um, uh, this Land Rover did not come with uh, um, the uh, what do you call it? The blind spot monitors are optional. And the Land Rover, but this one actually apparently comes with it, so that's nice. And they also have uh, cameras all around and lights here. This is, this is a very impressive vehicle uh, for something that was done in 2013. Um, uh, I don't know why nobody else does that, it's because they don't want to do it like Mercedes Benz or they have some sort of patent of that kind of design. Then, uh, but the position of Mercedes having theirs here uh, is not really cool, I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. The Land Rover, they have their um, window switches here. Uh, um, I wouldn't say I'm a fan of it, but this is the start stop button. See, see, this video, this video I'm making now, I, uh, I am discovering the car. Like, I, I don't really, need, really know much about how the car operates and everything. So the reason why I'm here is as I'm finding out things, I am showing you guys what I'm seen in this car right now so okay oh god okay the 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 engine is a little loud from here you guys can hear it obviously um, uh, I'm trying to uh, turn down the volume so let me okay now the doors are closed Ugh. wow so um this is my first this is me experiencing the Range Rover for the first time and uh, it's a really, it's a really nice, ex nice experience. Um, this car, it, it was well built. It was well built. It has leather everywhere. Like, everything is leather. Everything is leather. And every, every material here feels. Every material here feels expensive. Nothing here feels cheap at all. No wonder when people drive this car around, they feel like they're better than everybody. This, even the steering, this is leather. This is leather. Look at the gear. The gear is a knob. The gear is a knob. It has this uh, storage cup holders, and I believe these cup holders should be uh, cool. To like, you can actually cool your drinks or heat up your drinks. This is the uh, this is a cigarette lighter. Um, uh, here we have the pack then uh, from this uh, this is high this is height control this is the height control then here I guess are the different driving modes these are the different driving modes and then in the newer I think from uh, 2000 and uh, I think from 2000 and 2000 and, shit, I think 18, 
team as so here the entire system here and here are completely leds this is completely an led um display just like the instrument cluster the instrument cluster has completely um uh, led led screen and so it's here in the newer models which uh i hope that at some point i would uh i would experience out i'm sure i can get my hands on those so uh this seats here they're covered with um plastic but you can tell these are ventilated seats the seats are heated and cool um the adjustments goes really they go really back this is cool and uh, this is the back as they can go now i'm bringing it to front Okay, now let me uh, let's take a look at the storage compartment. It's, car, it's the storage compartment. It seems, it seems really big. So let me look at what's here. Okay, so uh, so all I can see here. Uh, okay, I think this cools. What does it do? I think I will press this button and see what's up. I don't know. Well, I think, I think, uh, I think uh, it has, I uh, uh, don't think this has wireless charging, but this is place for charging your phone. This is for the aux. Then uh, this should be cooling. Yeah, this place should be for cooling, chilling your drinks. I would find out and uh, it's, really, it's really nice. Then, so this part of the car, yeah, I remember in the older, in the older model, they had uh, two, what they call it, um, the golf club compartment, there were two of them. And it's the same here too two glove compartments which is very very nice comes in really handy two glove comp compartments so the papers let me see this oh. okay this is the handbook uh, i wonder where that this paper that comes with cars that tells you how many options and whatever whatever oh well this also has its own custom wipes for your interior Okay, so what's this thing that looks like a card? Kind of, what's this? Uh, yeah, it has to do with jump cables or what? Whatever. Um, okay, beautiful pouch, nice. Good. Uh. So now let's look at the sun visor. Ah, God, what's with the plastic everywhere? We have no light here. Okay, it has two of these. What the? Okay, two sun visors. Let me go back so I can get a clearer view of this. Okay, two sun visors. This is really nice. So you can move this one this way, and you can use this to block off the sun. Wow, perfect. This was well thought out. And uh, these grab handles are leather. These, Jesus Christ. Side airbags, panoramic roof all the way through I don't know if you guys can see it the roof is panoramic all the way through then now uh, over here what do all this do? okay this is for the roof I guess yes this button side to, uh, uh, to close and open the roof and for the glass what do all this do? this is for light So it's 
Okay. Okay. Before I forget, let me give you guys some specs on the car. It's, uh, it has 510 horsepower. At, it gets 510 horsepower at 610 uh, RPM. Um, um, it has uh, eight cylinder. That's a V8. And uh, okay, so let's let me go to the back seat and see what it's like. But first, yikes! This is the most comfortable place I have ever been in my life. This is comfortable. There's so much leg room here. And you have your own you have your own controls here, here. Climate control. Vents and everything everything feels expensive. Though this car is like how many years old? It still feels like six years old, it still feels really really expensive. It's super amazing. I think the next car I would uh, explore here now is uh is the Lexus LX 570. Let me see what it's like. It's you know, it's their flagship SUV. So, what I've heard about the car isn't so impressive, but I am gonna check it out. So, thank you. So, this is the end of the vlog. Okay.